Uh, my story is a long one. I am half British and half American. I did a master's degree in gender, media and culture and I've always been a very kind of gender activist person. Started working in tech startup companies because I used to do media and communications. Kind of saw a little bit of coding, saw a little bit of tech, always had like a thing for tech. And then un unfortunately, while I was at the last company, um, I was raped by a work colleague. Um, I do struggle with PTSD. I do struggle with anxiety. The beginning of this year, especially around the anniversary of the assault date, I really didn't think I would be here by the end of it. I, I really didn't, and I, and I got into a really dark place. And there are just some days that I don't even know why I'm still here. And not because I don't want to be, but because I can't remember how I got myself out of that place. Now that I'm kind of doing my therapy alongside learning how to code, it's so easy for me to see these things that are just very parallel. I, it feels like when I'm coding, what it feels like, there's part of my brain that's so turned on that it's almost like I'm not even here. And I forget that I'm here in this body with this history and this past, but I'm actually just in the code. It's almost like when you're dreaming or when you're reading a really good book and you forget where you are, but you're thinking everything all at once and you can just keep thinking things. And it just gets my brain, I use the term itchy. Like it, it just, it feels like I can feel things tingling inside there. And the only way to scratch that itch is to just keep coding. I, I have friends who don't really know why I'm doing this or like what's happened to me in the past year or so. But, and then I have family members and friends who can actually see how the like, positive coding has been on me. Actually, when I was preparing for my Makers interview, I, I tell people this often that my friends could say, well, we could tell the difference on the days that you're coding. You're more like yourself, that like little bit of spark is, is back. And so everybody that, even if they don't know what's happened to me, they've all been so supportive and they're all just so excited because it reminds me that I want to wake up and I want to do that and I'm excited to work and I'm excited to learn something new and I'm excited to break things and I'm excited when I see red instead of green and all of those things keep me wanting more and keep me thinking no I've got to I've got to still be here to do this I've got to do this and no matter what's happened to me in the past I'm still this person here that's learning this if that makes sense